so last last week we we ended up talking about aura the idea that art has got an aura or f- f- pictures pictures have, has got an aura um, and I wondered what you thought about the DJ. If we could go back to the, the DJ. Right. Because you have done live performances. Yes, I have. You've yes. done live live discos. Yes. And um, do you think the audience experience a DJ differently when I they're I think live? so, yes. There's a personal touch, I think, in the way. Yeah. And uh, also, they, you know, the DJ's there to play the music which they want to hear. Not what the DJ wants to play, <laughs> which is quite something, you know. So you have to go round what people are, you know, dancing to, yes, or sitting down to, or disappearing out of the hall, which I have had many times. <laughs> so they're just going. Well, I had a party up the road from us. We've got a hall, and uh, with, um, there's a party, and there's a pub up the road. So that all this party <laughs> went up the road, and I played lovely songs to myself or most of our evening <laughs> and got paid for it <laughs> so that's the best thing so well perhaps that's not the best example then no it's not about, but, um can we talk about charisma or what, what, it, you, you've never claimed to have an aura have you have you heard the word aura used about a live performance by a dj how, no, would, you, how I, would you explain it or the how what the dj does or yes, the, how the dj is experienced differently well if you come and meet me Oh, so in other words, it's, we're not going to understand this through radio. I don't think so. You have to come and meet a DJ to oh, find out. Right. There's two sides to the DJ. Yes. When you sit in the studio here, you're totally different. Yes. To when you're outside, okay. wandering around. Well, this this might be something to explore further. But I think I should mention mm-hmm. that this very uh, Friday, I think it's Friday, the tw- yes, Friday, the 28th of September. That's tomorrow. That's tomorrow. Mm. It's the Freshers' party. Right. And uh, Mike James will be there from the rock show on this very station, Phonic FM, and then from another station, uh, Daniel P. Carter. Right, I've never heard of Daniel P. Carter. No, before. We, we, don't, we don't really know who to do it. No, no. No, we are daytime, Mike James daytime people. people. Yes. But that's the trouble, Mike, you see. Mike James, we know. There's so many DJs, and you mm. listen to different stations from all over the Great Britain and the world. Yes. And somebody says, "Have you heard this?" or "Have you heard him?" And because there's so many of them, you just can't. You haven't got time we to listen know. to all. We don't no, know. You have to listen no. to pick and pick no. and choose. But we can we can say that this Daniel P. Carter, probably live, has a different quality to uh, the, on the radio, whichever radio oh, station. Oh, they have to change. That, the, the can't, be different. You know, we can do a show, we can sit down here and I can talk to you, but, you know, you can't do this in front of a lot of people wanting to dance. No, no, you can't. <laughs> um, so I just sort of, I, I think we have, to, we have to, to go into this because I think last week I was going on about the, the digital or, let's say, an app. If we, if we put um, illustration black and white illustration on, a, on an iPad mm-hmm. it wouldn't be quite the same as appearing in a gallery in the original woodcut let's say no we don't think no. I mean we were trying to argue last week just for the <laughs> no, sake no you have to see it in the flesh I think you would yes and, and the same is probably mm. true of a DJ Yes, we have to see them in the flesh. You definitely. Do. You do. So, that's <laughs> so c- come on down to the studio right now, and no, you can see no, Will no, in the flesh. Want, we don't want the, no, dear audience. Uh, even on Phonic FM one hundred and six point eight www No, we don't really want the audience in the studio. Well, I don't think. Well, no. Let, let us know. Come, email, come. email at studio. You can uh, always come to the coffee shop at the yes, shop. Yes. Yes. Come. Come, come to, meet come us to the, the Phoenix shop. Bar afterwards, and mm. mm. uh, we'd be delighted to see you. Mm. And uh, I don't, we haven't brought any recording devices this week. I don't. Th- oh no! I, I tell a lie. Chris has got an <laughs> yeah. iPhone. Yeah. And he can make video. Yep. Yep. So if you come along to the Phoenix Coffee Bar uh, about twelve o'clock. Well, give us ten, ten minutes you to get could, out of the studio. You could be. <laughs> you could be on the show next week. Yeah. But in general, no. What we do on the, and I, I well, I think I'm going to play another another track and then come back to this. JD. Okay. Ready on. Um, whether anybody's requested this, I I don't know. I don't think they have. Um, this is um, Nat King Cole, and it's Call the Police. <laughs> <laughs> 